Good evening and welcome back to the vlog. Sorry it started so late, but had some trouble with my footage from today. It all disappeared. So I have to start over, but it's okay. I'm gonna do the beauty review today. And then tomorrow I have something special for you guys. Um, so I'm gonna be trying out three different products that I got from Walmart. And I'm trying to compare them against MAC studio finish which I get from Macy's so we're gonna go ahead and jump right into this okay the first one we have is cover girls ready set gorgeous it's supposed to be oil-free foundation and no none of this is sponsored but hashtag Sponsor CoverGirl, Maybelline, or Wet n Wild, or even Mac. Hashtag sponsor. I'll wipe off all the stuff that's on my face from earlier. I'll take my nose ring out for this. Okay, would have did this in my room, but the lighting is horrible and it's better in here. So, don't know how to put foundation on usually you put a primer on but I'm not doing all this since I don't plan on wearing this for today and also you always want to make sure you blend it all the way in and I have spots here and there on my face from acne scars so never ever ever mess with your face when you have the acne just let that stuff go away or there's tools that can do it instead of your fingernails because your fingernails have tons of bacteria underneath them even if you wash your hands and try to pop your acne don't do that trust me it's bad okay so this is cover girl It's okay, but it doesn't really cover up anything. And I have lupus too, so my face turns like beet red. It's a little red right now. But I don't really like this one. So we're gonna wipe this off. And next, we're gonna try Wet n Wild Photo Focus supposed to help with pictures it's tested under seven different lights it's supposed to make you have a nice photo finish look it says even tested on iPhone cameras so we'll see how this does cover girl was about I think it was about six or seven dollars the wet and wild was only like four something and this comes with a neat little scoop stick oh God, so. if you hear yelling that's my 18 year old son playing his video game notorious for that i don't know if i like this one scoopy thing Oops. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it kind of like scrapes your face. I 
Again, make sure you get it all in. So I'm trying to find new foundation so that if I don't want to go to Macy's and buy it, I can find something to the equivalent to it. This one, whoop. It's okay, I mean. It's all right. I just got my eyebrows done today, look at that. Mm, they look great. I don't know. Not real impressed, but it looks okay. I mean. Not bad for $4.88 if you don't want to spend a bundle on foundation. But that cover on one, definitely not. Ah, I think they're just following that in my hand. Yeah, so I'm really upset. I was editing in my other vlog, my vlog from today. And I had to get rid of some stuff and I had to get rid of some of my footage because it needed to upload. But I was supposed to save it in another folder and it didn't save it. So that's where we're at this moment. Where I lost all the stuff that I did today. Which was, I had to get cupcakes. I had to take my self to the doctor and I saw the skin doctor. He said that everything looks like it's healing. I just have to now, um, and I'll show you what my skin looks like, but you can't roast me because it's because of my disorder. I, it looks bad, but there's nothing I can do about it. So let's see here. This is the Maybelline Matte Poreless. And it'll say that on here because there's a couple different versions of this Maybelline. They have different, eh, they have a couple different, um, let's see. This covers like the MAC. And a little bit goes a long way with this stuff. The other stuff you kind of have to put more then I had gotten pedicure because I so needed it. Ari had her own money and she got her own little she just had them painted because she's still too short for the the bell. Well, you can say I love this. Great coverage. It doesn't look cakey. I like it. See how my ears start turning red? It's one of the lupus problems. Your skin starts turning red. Well, this looks really good. I actually like this. This one, I believe, was only about $10. And it works pretty good. I like it. I think I will buy this. It covers really, really good. It looks just like the MAC. Hmm. Watch out, MAC. Maybelline made some nice stuff.
Not saying I don't love MAC, I do. But it's just nice to find something that's similar, especially for some people that can't afford MAC because it is crazy expensive. It's like $20, $30 for one bottle. But it does last a long time because my MAC has lost, lasted me about, um, usually it lasts me about a year if I space it out right. But then again, I don't wear makeup every single day because I'm a mom. I don't have time to do that in the mornings. Some days I do, some days I don't. I wear it more on the weekends when I have more time. But this is the MAC Studio Finish. If you don't know what it looks like, here it is. It's a very good product. I love it. But now I found a new one. So I will show you what my legs look like. And this is from Lupus and Sjogren's because you get dry skin. So I don't know how well you can see it, but this is what it looks like. It creates these little spots and I was scratching very bad to the point where um, I was making myself have sores. So it's taken a while to heal up. I even have some on my arms from that. So I had to be careful for a long time. I had to wear long pants, long sleeves. I was almost tempted to put socks on my hands so I wouldn't scratch at night like they do babies because it was literally ripping my skin apart, bleeding all over the place. Yeah, it was bad. I would wake up and be like, what the heck did I do to myself? <sighs> but anyways, this is going to wrap it up for the vlog. I hope you enjoyed this beauty review and I will catch you guys tomorrow. Bye.